Welcome to Dynamic Auto Painter 7. In this series, we will go through the major new features in bite-sized videos. Today's video is about creating gallery quality paintings. While the typical output from our software is already very high quality, now you can produce truly life-sized gallery prints using AI. For this, we need one more software. It's called AI Photo and Art Enhancer, and it is a separate product. One thing is important to mention, because it uses machine learning, it requires a fairly recent dedicated graphic card or GPU. Please use a trial version first to see if your computer graphic card is supported. Now when this is out of the way, let's see how it should be used with the Auto Painter software. First, we suggest setting the canvas output size to no more than 2400 or 3200 pixels. This may sound counterintuitive, right? We want the best quality after all. However, Setting the canvas output to these numbers will ensure the painting will have just the right artistic feel, while the next AI process will add the necessary resolution. Now all we need to do is to select a painting preset and hit the start button. As it paints, you can help a little by using your mouse to redirect the focus to certain areas. On the right side, you have a couple of buttons under mouse assisted painting. With area auto brush selected, the process will focus more on the area where you click. If you use the Fine Area Auto Brush button, both the area focus and brushes used will be smaller. That is a great way to add tiny details where they are needed. When the painting is finished, you can use any of the output tools to fix or enhance your painting. For example, you may remove or clone some parts in the Retouch tab, add an outline, enhance the canvas, and adjust the colors. But this video is not about that. Let's head to the Final Output tab. In version 7 we added a direct link to the AI photo and art enhancer. Of course, you can always save the painting first, then open it in the AI application. This is just to make our life a little bit easier. There are several models to choose from. The DAP painting model was designed specifically for this type of painting and it will add details and improve the paint texture. The PhotoSharp UHD is another great option, as it will add 16 times more pixels, resulting in a very detailed, ultra-high quality output. Set the location for your result image and click the Process button. This could take a minute or so depending on your GPU. Congratulations! A new, high-quality image of your painting has been created. By the way, you can open the newly generated image for preview by clicking on the top label that says Finished. And here you are. Thanks to artificial intelligence, you just created a truly gallery quality painting that can be easily printed in large poster size. Now, here's a little bonus. You can use AI Photo and Art Enhancer to also simplify your input images. Let's move back to Dynamic Auto Painter and select the input photo. In the menu plugins, use the Super Simplify option. This will send you back to the AI application, but this time the 3D Art Simplify will be selected. This produces a nearly vector-like image with most of the details omitted, so it may not be suitable for all types of artwork. You can tweak the result by going to Tools, General Settings, and playing with these parameters. Then, to refresh it, select the 3D Art Simplify preset again click process, which should go now much faster, and when it is done close the AIE and back in Auto Painter hit the OK button to grab the simplified image. Try it with some watercolor presets for example. Well, we are out of time. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to get notified about more of these videos. To get notified about any new software updates, sales and promotions, head to MediaChance.com and subscribe to our newsletter. Stay creative and see you soon!